In the last five meetings of these teams, Bill Bow in the dark strip have won on each occasion. The first quarter was a close run thing. Here's probably the most exciting incident. Montagnes is blocked here by Hamilton. The ball is fed to Vasilidis and then on to Alex Mumbrou who makes the basket. The key to the score is the quality of the block. Lamont Hamilton from the USA was on hand here to tie the game at 18 all. He weighed in with 16 points in this match. Into the second quarter now and Blancos de Rueda suddenly cut loose. Ian O'Leary from California added two points and at this stage the away side led by nine. But Bilbao are no pushovers these days. Look at this block by Alex Hervel and then Mumbrou provided the perfect assist for Hervel to find the target after breaking the length of the court. Blancos de Rueda have only won nine times this season and had a great chance to win here. Italian Antonio Porta got into the perfect position to score. This was arguably the changing point of the whole game. Just seconds left to the interval buzzer and Nikos Zizis lands a two-pointer. So, at the break, Rueda's lead was down to just two points. On the slow-motion replay, the part played by Mumbrou, who provided the assist, was crucial. And after the break, Mumbrou's influence on the game was beginning to grow. His three-pointer here, who landed just three out of seven attempts, gave the home side the upper hand. And Bill Bow's lead was soon into double digits. Adrian Mormon scores the basket, but there's a brilliant piece of play by Roger Grimau, who provided the assist. Roger was playing on the opposite side to his brother Jordi, a Blancos de Rueda player. I wonder if he's showing off in a sibling rivalry sort of way. Bill Bow now were in control, but Rueda were making a real fight of it. Nacho Martin kept the deficit to seven points in the final quarter. And when the lead was cut to just three, the home supporters were nervously looking at the clock. Porta with the points. The same player managed an extraordinary basket later. The Bilbao lead was still at four points, even with this score. It was certainly an outstanding piece of athleticism. There was slightly more than a minute to go when Bilbao scored this decisive basket. Vasilidis pulled off a terrific three-pointer and the home fans and the team knew they'd overcome formidable opposition. Three seconds left now and a consolation basket, little more from Blancos de Rueda. Nacho Martin had the last score of the match and from here Bilbao hung on to possession and the win. Bilbao are now fourth but level on victories with Barcelona. They could well be one of the surprise teams of the end of season playoffs.